Hello guys, Christian here, ready to bring you another squad builder for the day. Now today is going to be a 285k meta squad that I think is the best I have ever built. So let, without further ado, let's get straight into it. And for the goalkeeper, normally for goalkeeper, I tell you to go for just about anyone you want. It doesn't really matter. I'm not someone who stresses too much about goalkeepers in this game, but I have to say Anthony Lopez has been phenomenal for me. Best keeper I've used this game. In the right back position, I have gone with Rafinha, the one, the only, 5'8", medium, medium work rates, and he gets the job, he gets the job done for me, guys, he's very well, he's very well balanced, I slapped an anchor on him, upgraded that jumping, that strength, and make him just a little more of a defensive powerhouse. Not much to say or complain about him, he gets the job done every time, very sturdy, very reliable, no worries with him. Kim Pembe, the one, the only, you guys... In my squad builders, you will see a lot of Kim Pembe. He is one of my favorite. He's French, so he's very nice and easy to link with. So you're going to see him in a lot of my teams as he is just... He is very linkable, very good, very aggressive, very fast. Six foot two, of course. Could do... Not, not a fan of the work rates, but... Nonetheless, great player. And next to him, his defensive beast of a partner in for Marquinhos now guys you saw me recommend his inform in the last team and his his his, his normal card sorry about that but his inform just takes that to a whole nother level this guy is absolutely insane checks all the marks just one step better than that normal card and I highly recommend him guys highly highly recommend him. he is 60k so I recommend if you're ever buying Thiago Silva, think twice and pick up this guy instead. Left back. Left back is of course the one, the only, Alex Telles. One of the best left backs I've personally used in the games. Possibly the best because there's not, I'll be honest, there's not, there's not much variety in terms of left backs. So this guy, 5'11", high medium, clicks every checkbox you need in a meta team. Got the good stamina, good jumping. I decided to slap a shadow on him. Great crosser, guys. 89 crossing. Very good at making those overlapping runs and send it straight into the box. And next for my first center mid is going to be Leon Goretzka. Guys, I love having this guy on my team. Very well-rounded. Good work rate, six foot two, great stamina. Love this guy. Not much more to say about that. Oop. And next to him, Inform Verati. Now this now this guy, you guys, has the most in-game stats of any player in FIFA 18. And let me just tell you, it shows on the field. This guy is all over the place. Very fast, five foot five, medium high. His passes are next level. Next guy, next player in here, guys, is Allen. Now, Allen's most of a Allen's mostly a place fitter for the chemistry to make sure everyone gets on ten. Nonetheless, though, he does get the job done. He's an excellent player. Held holds his own in this team by far. Very good passing. Very good. Yeah, nothing bad to say about this guy. And into the attack. First player is my foot champions, Bellarabi. Now, I have not. Now, obviously, I don't have to pay for him as he is in my club, but I still incorporated his price into the team, so no, so no need to worry about that. And Bellarabi, compared to his partners, he is a little lackluster, I'll be honest. But um, nonetheless, he is in my club, so he is someone I like to throw in there. Obviously, gets that nice, sweet green link to Goretzka. But yeah, gets the job done. Now, the striker guys. Now, before I get into the striker, I just want to say he has been phenomenal for me. I picked him up because I saw his price tag, and he gets a very nice green link to a player we are going to get into in a bit. And that is Inform Bellotti. Yes, guys, Inform Bellotti has been phenomenal for me. As you can see, 26 games, 17 goals, 12 assists. Great return from this guy. Five-star weak foot. He is just, and I slapped the hawk on him to make that e that five star weak foot and that lethal shooting just a little more dangerous, guys. And this guy's a big boy. He can jump. He can hold off any defender. He's stronger. He's faster than most center backs. And he was great. Now, 
the best player in the team by far guys cannot say much about it. Cannot say enough about this guy. He has been absolutely phenomenal, tearing this team up every game. Man of the match, clutch goals, clutch assist, you name it, he's got it. The one, the only, Lorenzo Insigne. Guys, I've been trying to get my hands on Insigne for a long time, and I finally saw the opportunity to because I, because there weren't, there wasn't much variety in the Serie A in terms of good strikers until this informed Bellotti comes out. And he offers this green link, which makes it a lot easier to... Nonetheless, guys, in Lorenzo Insigne, 5-4. Now, guys, that... This 90 pace... Just take a look at this, guys. 90 pace, 91 dribbling, 5-4. foot four. This guy is lightning quick. Lightning quick, guys. And I decided... To slap an engine on him to upgrade that pace and dribbling even more. This guy is absolutely insane, guys. So short, so agile. The balance, the dribbling, the ball control. It all comes together to form this, this mini Messi, guys. Has been phenomenal for me, guys. I highly recommend if you're going to dish out anywhere near 30k in the left winger. Make sure it's on Insigne. This guy is absolutely insane. And here you go, guys. The entire team overall, we will go through the back line again. Rafinha right back where Kim Pembe next to Marquinhos alongside Alex Tellez. Very solid defense. All of course have great stamina, great pace, great physical, as you need in a meta team. Uh, midfield, all nice solid box to box midfielders. A little lacking on height, but nonetheless they are everywhere guys and they get the job done distributing the balls to my players. And the attacking front. Wow. Beautiful team, guys. I must say myself. So, guys, let me know how you enjoy this team in the comment sections. I really do hope you guys try it out. I believe it's around, It's the best team you can get for around 285k. If not, please let me know how I can make improvements to this team. And I will be working to make improvements and bring you an even better value team. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you have a great day, and I hope this helps you out in Weekend League. This is the...